Hey, welcome to Live DIY. Today I'm doing a hack. It's not a repair. I haven't done any research or testing. I just got upset at this router for being too loud, inappropriately loud, offensively loud, and I couldn't get any work done. I just took the thing apart, busted out the drill press, and fixed the problem the best way that I could. If you have one of these routers, don't do this. You might want to do this. So I'm making this video just to show you what it would take to do this if you thought that's what you wanted to do. Out of the box, this is the fan it came with. Even without the case amplifying the sound, you can hear this fan is super loud. What I'm gonna do is put in much quieter fans and I'm gonna put them right where this thing needs them instead of having a case fan like it has now. In case you're curious, here are the specs of the fans I'm dealing with today. Now, I'm just gonna cut the ends off the new fans. I'm not gonna show you the exact details of me soldering each wire, but basically I just wanted to make sure the wiring was the same as the fan that was in there before. And I'm just gonna match up the wires and solder them together. I didn't have a heat gun today, so I'm just gonna use my soldering iron to kind of cinch up some of the heat shrink and I'll tape it up later. Again, this is what it sounded like before. And when I plug in the new set of fans, it's much better, much better. To put these fans right where I need them, I'm gonna put this piece of paper on here, mark vaguely where on the case that these fans need to be, and mark the center. I used an old step-down bit with some water to go ahead and just butcher this case, getting the holes in the top. You know, and I grind down the mess, never mind the nice paint job, and let's just test it out. I forgot to record the drilling of the screw holes, but you'll need those to attach the fans, which will hopefully be right over top of where these heat sinks are. And when I put the cover on, the fans should be ready to go. Now I decided to turn the fans so that they blow out the heat rising off the heat sinks to sort of maintain the original airflow direction of the intake on the side of the case. So now this thing runs whisper quiet. I can't even hear it. It's fantastic. If you have one of these routers and you wanna make a modification, you might not wanna do this because it has other problems. I've created other problems. Like you can't set anything on top of it now. Things can fall into the case of the router. So you might want to start with just changing out the original case fan with just a quieter one. And I think you might be fine. Anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you found this useful. Please like, subscribe, put a comment down there, and I'll see you next time.